morning. I'm not going to say good morning because it is, we've had a blowing an absolute hoolie last night. We've had a slate come off the roof. So that's deep joy to fix. Welcome to Dice and Bolts. Bit of a special one this morning um, because we're not looking at a dice based system. We are looking at Spy Master, which is the first game uh, put out by a company called CM Games. Um, a little independent uh, guy, a couple of guys, a couple of brothers and uh, uses their system 21 system and the game itself is a game of uh, spies and men of mystery and international it's available on drive through rpg as and there's a, a pdf and a, a print on demand on it it's very system light very thematic it works so well so well for super spies and secret agents and that sort of thing and it uses a very, very elegant card-based system, as we can see. Uh, so Dr. Dice Cam today is being a Dr. Card Cam. I had to go a little bit more into the, the, the character sheet than I normally do on this one here. Uh, agents have four stats. So you have um, clubs, which is all... Uh, sorry, um, spades, which is all stealth and crime-related actions, including gunplay. Diamonds, which is like financial money and politics heart which is romance and socializing and so on it, it says underneath it, and then clubs which is hand-to-hand -hand combat and you'd have a, a number in each of these stats which is uh, based on how good you are with all of them now when you're making your characters in this game um you draw five cards and then you ignore the suits on the cards that you've drawn and then you associate those cards with the stats that you want or you can do it in order so if we say we have i can't do this upside down let's take this away so for there, oh, brilliant, king there, another four there, and an eight in there. So there, for the greater good of it, is an agent. So this is possibly going to be an agent with a little bit more, uh, less field experience than some of uh, some of the other agents that you may have come across, because they're kind of physical skills are particularly brilliant they're okay in the um like hand-to-hand -hand combat and the like the, the physical training side of things but when it comes to breaking and entering and shooting people the scores are a little bit lower and the whole flirting suave secret agent a little bit lower on that one again yeah but a king is actually pretty impressive on this one and it's called system 21 and anybody can play it every agent has their own deck of cards with two jokers inside it it's called system 21 because basically you're playing pontoon so if you want to do anything you player goes first and you twist a card off the top add it to whichever suit is based on the stat of the action that you're trying to do and you play against either a static difficulty number which uh, goes from sort of like 12 to 20 based on you know how difficult the task is that you're looking to get done or you're playing against the gm who has again their own uh card deck of cards and then you're playing pontoon against them so uh you also have a stack of chips uh you can what's called chip away a card you can normally start off with four of these and then if you get a card that you don't like or if, if it busts you you can spend a chip just to discard that card and then take it from there so for example uh this agent here is going to do a fairly uh routine task so a routine static task is difficulty 15. they're starting off with a king uh, and if they are trying to do like a, a money trail to trace where the laundered money is, is, is coming, is coming from. 19, stick at that one there, you do it, nice and simple. This, it goes into a discard pile. So you're playing against one static deck and this only gets refreshed when it is completely expired. So when it's completely dead. Nice thing about this uh, system is the way you take damage okay because the, you, you're going to get into a fight it doesn't track hit points it doesn't track weapons it doesn't track anything else and it says in the in the rule but where's all the guns and gadgets and it says it doesn't matter you know a highly trained agent can do as much damage with a pencil as he can do with a Walther ppk or a 40 cal desert eagle desert eagle it's all for flavor and that sort of thing 
you may not be able to knock a hole in a door with a pencil, but you can do with the Desert Eagle, and you might not be able to sneak a Desert Eagle into somewhere where you could sneak a PPK into. So that's kind of, it's, it's narrative, the equipment rather than that one there. You uh, get into a fight with a, a, a villain, villain's henchman, um, and you take damage. When you take a card of damage, so you lose the opposed draw, so where you're drawing against yours. So say, for example, you get into a, fit, a, fit, a fight, I've got 17, the dealer gets an 18, and you go, oh, I'll risk it and I'll twist it. Ah, bust. So I've lost this kind of round of the combat. I take one of the cards from my deck, put it in my effects deck. As soon as you bust on this, you're out of combat. You're knocked out. You wake up naked, tied to a chair, that sort of thing that happens. So again, if you're good at counting cards, this system is absolutely ideal because you can really leverage that ability on that one there. But you can kind of, okay, well, I've only got two cards worth of damage, but it's it's a pair of eights. You know, I'm not going to be brilliant. I've only got two cards worth of damage, but it's a pair of twos. That's just kind of cuts and scrapes and whatever. And your suit column might be popped up a little bit on that one there. Um, but that's the dice and bolts of the system 21, um, which is the core of the Spymaster um, role-playing game. Pick it up, it's about, I think, £10 for the PDF, maybe 15 I don't recall I uh, I got sent this one for various reasons, largely because my name's in the front of the book. Did some playtesting on it for, for Simat and Carl. Um, that's the dice and bolts of it. Uh, May the deck ever be in your favour. Believe in the heart of the cards. And I shall see you around.